The number of COVID-19 recoveries in the country has outpaced new cases for the ninth day straight. As a result, the total of active cases has now gone down to 36,797 in the latest daily COVID-19 statistics for Malaysia. This is a contrast from February 11, when the country's active cases were at its highest at 51,783. The figure is now closer to pre-movement control order numbers, where active cases were 30,390 on January 12. In his daily COVID-19 update, Health Director General Tan Sri Dr. Noh Hisham Abdullah said, Malaysia has 2,936 new COVID-19 cases on Friday. Selangor continued to record the most number of new cases at 978, which is 33.3% of the country's total. Johor came second with 730 cases, followed by Kuala Lumpur with 227 cases. In the same 24-hour span, 13 people died to COVID-19 while 4,889 patients were discharged. On the 13 new deaths, Dr. Noh Hisham said 6 cases were in Kuala Lumpur, 3 in Selangor, 2 in Sarawak and 1 each in Malacca and Johor. The deceased were between the ages of 53 and 84. All of them suffered from comorbidities such as diabetes, high blood pressure and heart disease. Dr. Noh Hisham said the ministry has also uncovered 13 new COVID-19 clusters in the country. 10 of the new clusters are infections discovered at workplaces in Johor, Selangor, Sabah, Sarawak and Kuala Lumpur. Two new clusters are community outbreaks. They are the Jalan Green Cluster in Sarawak and the Bukit Petiti Cluster in Trengganu. Meanwhile, the Kubang Jambu Cluster, also in Trengganu, is categorised as a high-risk group cluster as it involves infections discovered at the medical centre in Kuala Trengganu.